Caminando por una calle. It's a pretty uh, great place. Although the, the great thing about it is there's kids playing here and stuff. This is the schoolyard for, for the school behind me. Um, in 1938, they dropped the bomb. Or two bombs on here, 42 people, mainly kids, died, and then people tried to rescue them, and uh, they also died. Um, Franco and Mussolini, the dictators, the they're trying to uh, revolutionise against now. Um, they, they organised that, uh, that bomb. So, you can see the walls are pockmarked here. That's not uh, damage from, uh, you know, from time and history. That's, that's shrapnel from a bomb that was dropped on here. So, right, pretty real. two restaurants that I know of that Picasso spent a lot of the time in, he spent in Barcelona here and um, he couldn't pay for his um, his food and his, probably his wine um, and so he did some a lot of artwork here and at uh, Gato. Um, so we're going to go and try and have lunch in here if we can, if we can get a table, it's pretty hard to get a table so let's see how cool we can be. We didn't just get a table. We got the kitchen. We got the kitchen table. And uh, I was telling you that um, the castle used to hang out here. Let's run over the tree. Well, you know how we had to do some work to um, pay for this wine. Well, guess who I'm sitting next to? That's pretty cool. see that this place upstairs and downstairs is pumping very busy and we got the table of the house. So since everybody's drunk here all day, That was truly one of the greatest culinary experiences I've 
The food wasn't stand out or anything, but for ambience and experience, it was just, uh, just amazing. And the guy shouted me a uh, coffee with scotch afterwards. It's great. magical spot. I'm standing on the spot where Christopher Columbus met King Frederick and Queen Isabella when he returned from discovering America. He changed the face of Spain. He changed the economy here. It's changed so much of the world. Before that, People here didn't have things like potatoes, tomatoes, they didn't have corn, they didn't have so many things. And discovering the Americas really changed the face of Europe and economically and everything. It's like a pivotal, pivotal spot, you know? And I heard people who go to like Jerusalem and stuff and they like massively changed and have a massive experience about you know, walking in the footsteps of Christ and stuff but this is like I guess since then huge um, everything that happened is, is pivotal on that moment because even discovering Australia everything is massively like changed because of this moment where he returned from discovering uh, America so I'm standing on that spot Cool.